What's going on, everybody? My name is Danny Ferrari. My name is Parker Immense. We are Excellent Sound. Parker's back from China. We've got a new remake for you guys. Boombox, that new whip. Pull up Let's in the Rari, that's a new whip. What is up, everybody? My name is Danny Ferrari. I already said that shit. We are back with another remake. Boombox Cartel. New whip. New song. Killer song. We got a new whip for you guys. Cartel Volume 2 is out now. We're going to be going over one of the sounds in this drop right now. And the sound is actually in Cartel Volume 2. So just a little surprise for you. If you guys got the new pack, just drop a little fire emoji little right fire. in the comments. What are you guys thinking of the pack, bro? Yeah, Let tell us, us what you think. Make sure you guys are subscribed, like, follow us on Instagram, all that shenanigans. Uh, Parker's back from China. We're going to talk about how you guys can get this project file in a little bit, but right now we got the free download and the rack in the description below, so make sure you guys go grab that. Oh, yes. So the sound we're going to be doing today is going to be this one. Classic, classic classic boombox classic hybrid trap sound dude classic boombox cartel we nailed the sound we're gonna be going over all the elements it can be super cool i don't have any time let's get into it let's jump right in so first i have everything already initialized for you guys uh to make sure it sounds super cool i went ahead and duplicated the track from above some of the automation i'll kind of go over it briefly but uh let's hear what it sounds like just initialize what do you say parks let's fucking hear welcome it, dude. back bro thanks man i missed you dude. back in america they separate us dude parker got trafficked yeah dude <laughs> traffic is not a joke sorry <laughs> i should not say stupid shit did not get trafficked <laughs> i say I, I got saved you got saved yes parker's in china or went to china he's back i stayed home launch cartel let's hear how this sounds let's fucking go Pull up in the Rari, that's a new whip. Okay. I'm still waiting for that in it saw drop, dude. Someone I could know, just nail dude. it. I fucking love that shit. Uh, some of the things we got going on. This sound is actually being layered in the second part of the drop uh, here. Uh, let me actually let me minimize that so you can see. So we have like this little groan sound. I'm not going to be going over that, but the very beginning of the sound, like the classic boombox sound. We're using it as a layer in the second half. In the beginning part, it's by itself. So we're going to go over that right now. I'm going to hit my mic. Just fucking hit I'm that pumped, shit bro. Dude, I'm pumped as I well. I got my boy back, bro. We're, fucking, we're back, dude. We're back. We're fucking in it. I had to do a video by yourself, dude. I was scared. I know, dude. I saw I saw the video. <laughs> so uncomfortable. <laughs> Spinning, dude. Spinning. Spinning around. Yeah. We're in the same sweatshirt for three weeks in a row. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> okay. So I got serum pulled up. Oh, uh, man. Well, I got some macros, macridge, macro engine. Yeah, dude. What did I do to myself? I don't even know if this stuff's doing anything. Oh, we got pitch bend. That's why. Yeah. Okay, let's, so let's get it started. Let's go ahead and start with basic shapes. Boombox likes to do a lot of FM synthesis, so we're going to do the same. The best type of way to do FM synthesis that the, is with basic shops. It's the best. So we're going to start with a sine wave on oscillator B. Oscillator, uh, sorry, on oscillator A. Oscillator B is going to be a saw wave, but it's going to be the basic shape ones. We still don't know if it's any different from the... Nobody's answered it. Nobody knows. Nobody fucking dropped in the comments Thanks yet. a lot, Duda. Thanks, dude. Bro, did you see that video for the new update that he was kind of playing around with? Yes. How you can automate this stuff? Oh, dude. It's That's going to be crazy. Sick. I'm going to do some crazy. I'm going to automate right. the shit out of it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go ahead and put oscillator B to plus three on the octave, and I'm also going to put p put plus, uh, plus two for the semitones, and then for the fine tune, minus 23. This is like a super like weird tune set. It was super hard to get the tuning right. Um, so that looks good. I'm going to go ahead and set the uh, unison on oscillator B to two. I'm going to turn the detune all the way down. Randoms all the way up. Blend is there. Wave tail position good. This doesn't matter. Uh, level all the way down. Bam. Okay. Uh, oscillator A. Let's go back over there. We're going to go ahead and select for the warping FM from Bizzle. Bizzle. I was going to say that, Dude. bro. Go ahead and put that at like 50%. Was it 49 or 50? 49. 49. All right. Let's hear how this is sounding. Oh, oh that was cool. Pretty 
cool. Bendy. All right, next, let's go ahead and make our first LFO. It's going to be our main volume envelope LFO. It's going to look a little something like this. Go ahead and pull this towards the one, almost to like this little dash area. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go ahead and clip her down like so. Clip About all the way down. Three quarters of the way to this box. Uh, set it to envelope and leave it on quarter. Should be sounding like this. Oh, I didn't do anything. So let's go ahead and put this on some stuff. Let's go ahead and put it on the level. Super quick LFO. While we're at it, let's go ahead and initialize. Oh, I need to move the serum over. There we go. I didn't nice. miss anything. I'm going to go ahead and initialize the sub oscillator. I'm going to go ahead and set it to direct out. I'm going to put it on sine wave. I'm also going to turn the level down and put LFO1 on the sub level. And I'm going to pull that back to a little bit around 50 forts or 58. Fifth sevs. Fifth sevs. Five sevs. Yep. Nice. Okay, cool. I accidentally put this to minus one semitone. Let's put that to zero. All right, that's looking good. Let's go ahead and initialize the noise oscillator. We're going to use analog, and we're going to use bright white. And I love this new feature in Serum Direct Out, but we're not going to be using it. We're going to go ahead and pull down the level knob and put LFO1 on the level. Pull that down just a little bit. We're going to put that to 18. Get a little bit of that dirt in there. Like so. Like so. Uh, next, we're going to go ahead and go ahead and set it to mono. And I'm going to go ahead and add our first filter. Make sure oscillator A is going to it, which it is. Uh, and we're going to use a flange filter. It's a flange minus. It's going to be in miscellaneous. No, it's going to be in flanges. <laughs> flange <laughs> minus. Set the cut. Now, the cutoff is really important. So the cutoff is going to be at 88 hertz. I'll let me make sure I turn this on. There we go. Oh, no, it's farther down. 707. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, it's because I have the note on it. That's yeah. right. Uh, make sure key tracking is on. We're gonna fix that in a second. Uh, I'm gonna pull down the cutoff a little bit more. I for oh yeah, there we go. Once the key tracking is on, then we can set it to 88 hertz. Nice. Yeah. So every time uh, a new note is is implemented, that uh, cutoff is essentially moving to where that note should be. So it's a little bit more tuned. I'm gonna go ahead and put LFO one on the uh, resonance knob. The resonance knob should be all the way down, actually, right? Mm -hmm. Resonance knob all the way down. Put LFO one on the resonance knob and pull that down to 50 toots. Should be sounding like this. Nice. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and add LFO. Is LFO 1 on the cutoff? No. We're going to add this little note feature just to kind of help with the tuning a little bit. We're going to add this note onto the cutoff, and we're going to pull it down just a little bit. It's going, what is it, going up or down? Did yeah, you just move it, bro? Not, no, I didn't. <laughs> three. Yeah, three. It's going up. Really, really sharpie right there. Nice. Okay. So let's keep moving on. I'm going to go ahead and add a new LFO. This LFO is going to be something like this. This be LFO 3. I like to use this one for my tunage. And is it like, oh, wait, no, it's like this. Like it's Other way around. Like that. And then go from here. Wait. Yeah, I'm at a point there and pull that one down like so. And then pull this one down. Oops. And then pull this one back up because I messed up. Nice. It's like a weird little pitch tuny thingy. Yeah, and this one's going to go a little bit past the first one. It's going to go to, like, right there. Mm -hmm. This is going to be set to envelope and leave it on to quarter. Everything should be on quarter, I believe, right? Yeah, and we're going to mess with that a little bit later. Nice. Okay, let's go ahead and get into the effects. Um, I'm going to go ahead and load them up. I'm going to go menu, load effect chain. Got it saved right there. Whip it. Whip Bam. It. All right, first things first, hyper dimensh. Okay. Uh, rate at 40, detune at 25, mix at halfway, 51, size all the way down, mix at 30 forts. No LFO -age. Um, should be widening it up. Nice, a little bit more phasey. Next, we're going to go ahead and add a tube distortion. This tube distortion, um, put the drive all the way down and the mix around 66, and then add LFO 1 to the drive and pull that down to a little bit past halfway, 59. Mm hmm get nice and sharp uh next we're gonna add an eq we're just gonna do like a little high cut over here uh frequencies at 746 and we're basically making this wait no this would be a, a low pass a low pass or a high cut yeah we're gonna put this on the frequency of the right side and set that to 30 toots so that's opening up nice that's looking good and then let's go ahead and add an ott uh, threshold at yeah, you know me. <laughs> minus 24, race at 4 over 1, attack 90, release 90, gain at 
And then I'm gonna go ahead and add this LFO on the threshold too, so the sound gets really loud and very compressed towards the end. Was it minus 29? 28. Minus 28. I like really kind of messing with, with uh, the threshold of uh, the multiband. Bring down the master just a little bit. Okay, next let's go ahead and add a high pass filter. I think what I did with the, this one in Cartel Volume 2 is I, uh, I added some like reverb and macros and stuff like that so it's a little bit more because we can only do so much in Serum by ourselves. Yeah. So we try to make it sound as good as possible. But we kind of dialed it back for this remake because we went to do post-processing. So uh, with this, we have a high pass filter for uh, the last effect here. It's a high six, it's a normal right here. Cutoffs at 30 sevs, res is at zero, drives at zero, pan, blah, 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 mix at 100%. I'm gonna go ahead and add a, um, oh wait, come on, so, yeah, okay, that's it. Yeah. It's just essentially just doing a high cut. And essentially, if you put reverb on here and chorus and all that stuff, it would probably sound closer to it. If you did not get Cartel Volume 2, you could probably do like reverb. You gotta do reverb. That's pretty close. And then maybe a chorus uh, too would probably help it. But that's it for this sound right now. We're gonna go ahead and get into, oh no, we gotta do LFO 3. LFO 3, well, let's go ahead and do that real quick. So go into the matrix. I'm gonna say LFO 3, I want you to adjust the global master tune and you want to set it to how it is going bipolar uh and that's what is that at minus one minus one just a teens how 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 boombox always has the craziest tuning man they do man it's so difficult um so that's pretty much it so far let's go ahead and get into processing but before we do that uh, if you guys want to get this project file, we have it right now on our Patreon for our YouTube tier. It's 10 bucks a month. You get all the YouTube uh, project files that we do. We have a bunch already up there, so you have access to like almost 30 now uh, since back to like November of 2018 or something like that, September. Yeah, and if you think about it, 10 bucks for 30 preset or 30 project files. Not to mention all the samples that we make, all the extra presets that we make, all these extra stuff that you see in here, all this stuff is all in there and it's all organized and it's all ready for you to just take and download and you have nice little file folders and nice mm -hmm. racks for them, everything. Yeah. And of course, project file to learn from. Uh, and the samples are insane. Like all these drums, man, with the sub, dude, listen to this. <laughs> <laughs> it was just like, a so yeah, a bunch of stuff in there. I don't want to talk too much about it, but uh, again, uh, if you like these type of sounds, the reason why we wanted to do this a big remake, we love doing Boombox Cartel remakes, and obviously we have Cartel Volume 2 that is out now, guys. It is out. We're going to be sending out an email to you guys, uh, probably to give you guys some, so we want to give away some free stuff. Yeah, everybody who's on the mailing list, we're going to send you guys something special this week. Yeah. So look out for our email. Uh, promoting Cartel Volume 2. Uh, remix mm -hmm. contest for this song for Big Gas for the demo track uh, will be announced shortly. We're getting everything together. We got some prizes, which is awesome. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude. We got some I'm vendors. Super stoked for this that are sponsoring it. I, can I say it now or should I wait? No, wait, wait, okay. wait, wait. We'll but yeah, we got some. We got some stuff to give away. Uh, we're gonna buy some stuff, I'm sure, and like add some more cool, some stuff. more cool shit for you. So we're gonna do it really big. We're just trying to do it right and nice and really good for you guys. So we're really excited about that. So go check out Cartel Volume Two. Cartel Volume One is on sale for fifty bucks. Cartel Volume Two is the regular price. Uh, so yeah, go grab it, guys. It's got a ton of sounds. It's got 150 presets. 150. It's Hyper Trap, Future Bass, and it's got like 500 samples. I think. Crazy songs. Tons of loops. Yeah. And of course, the project filed a big gas. Anyway, that's enough selling. Follow us on Instagram. Okay. <laughs> At X L N T Sound. I see how I'm sign languaging it. Uh, all right, let's get into the processing. This is a big part of it. Uh, first, what I did. We'll go ahead and turn this on. We'll go one by one as I added a corpus to get, make it more pipey, I would say. Piper down. Piped out. Um, so the chorus, uh, corpus, I got like the tune at 161. Opening is 100. Pipe decays at 93. That's the main thing. And dry wet at 100%. <laughs> kind of adds to like the weird tuning. More tuby. Uh, yeah, more tuby. Thank you, Parker. Well, it's actually more pipey because if it was more tuby, you would choose Oh, there tuby. is a tube, yeah. Pipey. <laughs> That like sounds pretty cool too, actually. Pipe. Yeah, I kind of like Tubi. Yeah, but we're gonna stick with Pipey because that's what we did. Piper down, baby. All right, Corpus. Uh, next we have uh, an EQ. Let's see, just a low cut. Bring it up. Get that gnarly frequency. That's probably the Corpus right there. 
Uh, let's go ahead and add a reverb. Now we're doing a reverb throw. We're just automating the dry wet, which you can see here. It's kind of cool because it gets, if I noticed in the song, it gets like super wet and then it starts getting less dry. And then it's just like throws, like short reverbs. Okay, so that reverb's just kind of set like this, make low cut, high cut. This is all stock. Decay is at, uh, sorry, yeah, the decay time's at 1.60, and then we're automating the dry wet to throw it. At like 20%, and at the very beginning, it's at 39%. Rack is in the download description as well. Uh, OT sizzle to bring out that uh, big old reverb. Uh, output set to 10, time 500%, and amount at 100%. Uh, we added the 10 dB. I kind of learned this trick from uh, FOMO. Shout out FOMO. Because the when you already put on a, a, an OTT at 100%, it always sounds like too much. So I always dial, bound, dial back to dry wet, which yeah. I like doing still. But uh, if you add 10 dB of output, it kind of makes it sound how essentially it should sound. Not super. It's still super compressed. Yeah. But it brings the volume to where it should be. It's a makeup It brings like game. the mids and everything back. Yeah. It's really throwing that reverb too. Uh, next, we got a saturator, 7 dB. Holy shit loads. Soft clip, uh, 100%. This is basically stock. And then we go ahead and have a nice little touch of EQ with a low cut around 240 and cutting off a little bit of the highs. Oh. Some of the some of the stuff that I'm doing is I'm actually I had this uh, macro I think that's what no serum reverb I had this reverb kind of turning on and off uh, you don't really need to do it you could essentially just add an effect and then add like a reverb with the LFO yeah I think that's what it is. but I don't even think I actually I, I think I did it and I think I turned it off I don't think it's actually really doing anything but sounded better doing it in the post. Yeah, exactly. Some of the other automations, uh, Macro One, that's not doing anything, so don't worry about that. Um, but that's pretty much it for this sound. Some of the other sounds that are in here that are really cool that you get with the Patreon is like this robot sound, which is layered with it together. I like that sound a lot. This yeah, like super bear grillsy stab, which I bounced, uh, resampled, sounds like this. Just like in the background. Um, yeah, I don't want to go over all of it, but um, that's pretty much it, guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Again, we are at XLNT Sound. Go grab Cartel Volume 2. If you like Cartel Volume 1, you like you will like Cartel Volume 2. If you don't have Cartel Volume 1, you should. And you guys already know the you game. Should. You, you guys got to get the newest pack. Get it. Throw that shit in your songs. Put it in there, bro. Before everybody else. Yep. Yeah. You don't only have so much time, bro. Exactly. We're giving it to everybody. Let's fucking go. Let's go. Let's play this one out. Am I forgetting anything? No, nope, I we, think you got it. We are at XLNT Sound. 16. That's the tag. Thousand subscribers. 16 motherfucking K. Comment how long you've been subscribed for. Yeah, who's the oldest? Who's the oldest sub and Weber? Who's the oldest sub and Weber? Let's see. Dude, we have sub and Webbers in China, bro. We got sub and Webbers in Korea. In Korea, Parker got recognized in China. Oh yes, numerous times, and you it was get crazy. Recognized everywhere, bro. It was crazy, man. <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah, you got a very recognizable face. I guess so, dude. Just, yeah, you know, handsome, very handsome, handsome face. God damn, you're a good-looking guy. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and play this out. We'll see you guys in the next one. Look forward to seeing more videos, a bunch of new stuff coming up. We are at XLNT Sound. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you next week. We'll play this out. Oh. Pull up in the Rari, that's a new whip. Okay.